This is Bumper to Bumper TV. If a car ever had feelings of segment envy, then the VW Eos might be considered one that is trying to overcompensate to match the competition. This is a subcompact on the edge of the luxury segment that's a convertible hardtop. The other players in the niche are luxury offerings like the Volvo C70, the Mini Cooper convertible, the Chrysler 200, and BMW's 135SI. So you can see there aren't a whole lot of players out there. On paper, the EOS claims seating for four, but on a 101 inch wheelbase, you can imagine rear seat legroom and comfort will be at a premium, since some interior space is lost to accommodate the retractable roof system. Like most convertibles, it's heavier than expected at 3,500 pounds. The extra weight is to provide the stability, usually associated with hard tops or sedans built on the same platform. In road test, the open tops EOS was rock solid, even on expressways with larger vehicles passing on either side. Mechanically, VW has taken the simple approach, offering just one engine now, a 2-liter two TSI two turbocharged 4-cylinder. The plant delivers 200 horsepower and 207 foot-pounds of torque when using premium grade fuel. It is worth noting that this is considered a super ultra-low emission vehicle. There is one transmission, a 6-speed DSG dual-clutch front-wheel drive gearbox. In most city driving situations, there isn't much need for something this sophisticated, but it proves its worth on the open road. With three trim levels and two wheel options, the EOS is designed to provide a luxury level experience for the mainstream brand. If the Beetle Softtop is considered an open car for the masses, then this might be considered the VW offering for the managers and entrepreneurs who are climbing the corporate and social ladder without getting too far from their comfort zone. This is Greg Morrison. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper TV at cs.com.